It looks like road conditions are slightly improving tonight after some parts of I-84 were closed down due to icy conditions. At one point, some truck drivers say they didn't move an inch for hours. Jennifer Off stopped by the TA truck stop in Boise and has more in tonight's big story. Well, Don, the Idaho Transportation Department says after reopening most of the interstate, there are now some lane restrictions on I-84 westbound along a five-mile stretch near Hammett as crews are cleaning up the scene of an accident. Also, truck stop workers say they're dealing with one of their busiest days ever. A line of trucks on I-84 seemed to stretch on and on near the Broadway exit in Boise. Mother Nature threw us a curve. The Travel Centers of America truck stop in Boise was crammed with trucks left and right. We've got uh, probably twice the vehicles that we normally do here on the location in excess of 200 trucks and 60 to 70 private vehicles. And by this afternoon, the truck stop's parking lot was completely full. I'm parked clear down around the corner about four blocks away and walked over. I knew not to even try and come in here because I'm too, too, too tight. Some of the truck drivers say they've been stuck at the truck stop since last night due to road closures, but they say they've dealt with even worse. It's better to be off the road and park and wait in here than be in a ditch somewhere in the middle of nowhere. Despite being stuck for hours, the truck drivers we talked to didn't lose their sense of humor. Even with this advice to drivers, keep even more distance from large trucks during these icy conditions. Respect the big truck. Because we can't stop like, like a car can, so stay the hell away. I can't say Serious. that on TV. Yes, I can. <laughs> it turns out he can. Now transportation crews urge commuters to drive slowly and be extra careful. You can also call 511 for the latest traffic updates before heading out the door. Live in the studio, I'm Jennifer Aw. Today, six on your side. We understand what he's talking about.